Hello guys, in this video we will be talking about the Cori cycle. Lactate is produced in the muscle when ATP demand exceeds the capacity of oxidative phosphorylation. Anaerobic production of ATP through the glycolysis or glycogenolysis generates the end product lactate. In Cori cycle, Lactate is transported from muscle through the bloodstream to liver where it can be converted back to glucose. In the liver, lactate is converted first to pyruvate by the lactate dehydrogenase. Pyruvate is converted to glucose through the gluconeogenesis pathway which requires the hydrolysis of ATP and GTP. Glucose produced in the liver is transported through the bloodstream to the muscle tissues again where it can be used or stored as glycogen. This is called the actual Cori cycle. Now you can see in this picture. So Cori cycle is all about just transferring this glucose and glucose intermediate glucose and lacto lactate or lactic acid from liver to muscle and from muscle to liver via the bloodstream for the need of glucose in the muscles or liver. 